I'm Dan Johnson, and I'm talking here with a pair of Alexes <laughs> from the Aero Adventure Company in the Aventura airplane. People get that a little confused, me included once in a while, but I think I got that right this time. Nailed it. So the reason why we wanted to talk to both Alexes about this is the airplane is uh, one thing that we've already reviewed in the past, but you've got the Aero Momentum engine on here. Some people go Aero Momentum. I don't know Aero Momentum. It's a Suzuki engine. So is it some scrapyard thing or, you know, what is it? Is it is this a new engine? That's a great question, Dan. We get that quite a bit, actually. Yes, this is a brand new crate motor. So it comes from Japan, I want to say, um, in a box. And then at that point, Mark does quite a bit of engineering to it to make it the way it is currently on the aircraft. This is um, Mark Kering, Kettering of uh, Aero Momentum, correct. who supplies the engine to you. That is correct. But he's not sending you some old thing. He's no. sending you a well. This is a brand new. He actually runs every engine before it comes to us. So okay. he provides us with the dyno. Um, spec sheet, everything else. So when we get it, we know that this is already a turnkey setup, which is great for us because it literally is a turnkey setup once we have it mounted to run the fuel. Sure. Rust is really what makes a difference for us on this engine, especially when you deal with a seaplane getting it on a step and out of the water. Right. You really need that oomph. And so the power is plenty, but that thrust is just amazing. Tell me a little bit about your experience with this engine on this airplane. Sure. And the whole idea was to offer options for our customers, you know, and, and affordability is a big deal with our customers. So having something that's able to be fully capable in terms of water landing on water landing on land and then choosing their own engine options is great so with this one um, we have quite a bit of thrust which is what we like so you have anything from 100 horsepower and they go up now to 149 I want to say but uh, this one happens to be 117 and it's an upright so it's a real clean install for us very easy comes with a wiring harness you're not spending a lot of time like with the Rotex is trying to wire everything um, this is a very straight simple install we get about 530 pounds of static thrust, so it has a lot of oomph. Is that right? This that's, propeller that's, that's has a, a lot, lot of bite. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so like I was telling you earlier, in terms of the flying characteristics, um, especially even when we just do a crow hop, which is our first test, um, this thing will take off at half throttle, and it really takes almost cutting that back to bring it back down to the, <laughs> grand, to the ground. It'll, it'll cruise down the runway at about a quarter. You know, so it's, it's quite impressive when you can do that in, in something like this. So get me in the rough range, and we'll caution folks to say you may be watching this a few years from when we recorded it, so things change. We'll get you to Alex to find out more about that, but get me in the ballpark anyway, because I know your numbers are good. Sure. So with the AM13, which is a 100 horsepower power plant, and this airframe as a kit will cost you at the air show 40000 normal pricing is about 41000 and that's not 140,000. Nope, that is not. That yeah. is, yeah, you keep the 100. Now, if you want to give it to us, we'll take it by all means. But yes, 40,000. Now, the that's a kit. Okay. That is so a it's kit. not a flyaway aircraft. Correct. What's the build time? Rough parameters. I know that varies a lot, too, depending on an individual and what they do to it. But, sure. But typically, what does someone spend? It's about 250 to 300 hours, and that's okay. realistic. A lot of that is spent for our customers have been on wiring in the past, and with this option, it kind of alleviates that. comes with a wiring harness. It's very plug-and-play type scenarios. So. Okay, so those are both the price point and the build time involved are, are very low, and this is for a seaplane. Those would be good numbers for any oh, land sure. airplane. For a seaplane, they're, I, I think they're spectacular numbers. And the airplane's been around for a while. I've asked you this on videos Over before, but I always years, like to so. find out. 25 years and mm -hmm. about how many airplanes? I know you didn't build them all, so. Yeah, we're, we're close to 300 probably out okay. there flying now. 300 so. flying aircraft. So that's a good performance parameter, long time, quite a few airplanes out in the field, lots of different pilots, and the experience for most people has been good. Oh yeah, it's, Great. A, it's definitely, like you said, it's been around for a long time, so over 25 years, it's got flying history behind it, and we're still here supporting it, so it's a great airframe. Now, if you'd uh, hand the microphone just briefly to Alex, I'm going to ask you a couple of questions like, okay, so sure. so I say, man, everything I just heard is perfect. i got to have one. I want that engine. I want this airplane. I want all that other stuff. How long would you quote me before I could have it if I if I said, this is what I want? Uh, typically, uh, we'd do a 60 to 90 window to get you a kit. 60 to, to 90 you. days. Yeah. Okay. Two or three months, and you got the stuff you need, yeah, including definitely. engine and all the bits and pieces. Is that yes, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. That's very good. Can you help people build them in any way? Do you have a we build do. center we or do, something? We do or how's have the capability of helping people do uh, what we call a builder assist. Uh, pretty much help them build a 5149 kit, help them... 49% uh, of the way if they needed that built so up. So they can come or to your facility and do this stuff? We can do that, or we could also help them the whole way, uh, you know, do from beginning to, to the end. Basically, they could be as involved as they, they want to from the beginning to the end, as they, as long as they commit to 51% of sure, that. Sure, sure, of course. And, and we know that FAA permits you to help with the most difficult parts, and of yeah. course FAA likes sure. that because the most difficult parts you don't want to get wrong, obviously, right. nor does anybody, nor does FAA. So they do let you do 
they don't let you build it for them, but they let you help quite a bit. Yeah, and, and a lot of it will be more instruction and, and showing them, you know, instead of putting a certain part first, one before the other, certain arrangements and things like that. But our kits are pre-drilled, everything's pre-bent for you, so there's very little left for you to actually um, machine out yourself or drill out. Mostly everything's done for you, about 90% of the things. There's a little bit of drilling and things like that. You'd have to do your own. A little sure, bit sure. of riveting, but everything is probably bolted on and, and things like that as far as the airframe goes. Okay, great uh, stuff that way. Um, so where are you located? Right here. We're located right here in the land. Uh, You're about a thousand airport. people. Or, yeah, right, we're, we're or right over like there. That. We're at 915. Right over, right over Alex Gutierrez's shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> right over here. We're at 915 Biscayne Boulevard, uh, Sweet A, here in the land, Florida. All right. So, so somebody could say, you know what? I'm going to come to that show next year, and I'm going to buy an airplane ahead of time, and I'm just going to come right over there and do it. They could stay here. There's a lot of great eating in town. There's hotels in town. All kinds of ways for you to accommodate folks that want to fly in. Certainly. But say somebody's in California. Uh, then you've got uh, manuals and stuff. Now, as I recall, you folks did a lot of work on yes. cleaning that up from how it was earlier. How do you feel about the status of your instructions today for that? Let's say it's an Alaska pilot, somebody's just too far away to come here very often. Um, I think like with everything, um, we're still there for them as a great uh, uh, part of the technical support during the building. Um, anything you deal with, uh, like building a piece of furniture from Ikea, even a drawing like that still leaves certain things up for the imagination, unfortunately. <laughs> yes, they do. So it's still a work in progress, but I think we're a million miles away from where we used to be as far as some of these technical drawings go and the assembly manual goes as well. Sure, well, they can always get better. That's yeah, true exactly. of everything in life, so well, I would expect you'll... Support, we're, we're very pleased. I mean, customers can reach out to us at any point. And with the manual now having been redone, it, it does limit that imagination part. <laughs> Good. That, well, we like the sound of that. So, uh, I, again, I kind of want to come back to the engine now. We we talked with uh, Mark Kettering from Aero Momentum, who is the supplier of the engine to you. Mm -hmm. He gave us some uh, numbers about when it's available. He's fairly quick, too. So, so you can really fulfill on that promise of those dates. I mean, that, that's, that's a real achievable thing. That's not like, well, we can do that if you order today. But... Correct. Six months from now, it's going to be six months wait. Exactly. Not that way then. Nope. Exactly. Okay, great. So Aero Adventure, Aero Momentum, Aventura. You're right at the top of the alphabet there with yeah. a lot of stuff. Yeah, That's yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> AAA rated. That's good. <laughs> All right, give us a web address where we can find out how to find reach you and Alex sure. uh, at the factory. And uh, what's the web address, Alex? It is uh, www.c, that's S-E-A, and then hyphen P-L-A-N-E dot com. Okay, great. I've got more information about these aircraft. I have flown them. It's been my pleasure. I'm looking forward to flying this particular one before too long. You can find that in all kinds of affordable aviation on bydanjohnson.com.